Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Trigger Blind. Last time we made our way through the Ocean Palace. This time we're just going to move on ahead and see what we have. We have a button and this button does absolutely nothing. Okay, well let's check the sides then, I guess. Um, a scouter. Okay, well that's no- okay. Okay, so one of each scouter. So then we want to use lightning on you. We're going to have Luca use fire on the red one, and then we're just going to normally attack the blue one. That's how this is going to work. So now just focus on this guy. So I hope, I'm thinking we probably don't have much farther, jeez, the crits. We probably don't have much farther to go in this dungeon. I'd hope, we've been at it for quite a while. And it's, I don't know, is that a thing? Hold on, is that a thing that, ooh, Luca learned Mega Bomb. Actually, you know what, we haven't checked to see what um, text everyone learns next. So you get Air. oh my god. 20 MP, ultimate damage on all enemies. So I'm assuming that's like an ultimate lightning move or something like that. You get Flare, strongest fire magic attack. Looks like that's the equivalent to Air. You get Uzi Punch. Hit enemy with Multi Punch. Okay, so that's, that's not ultimate. In fact, you have less things than we do. So I'm assuming you're a while away from your ultimate. Well, I mean, we haven't been using you as much. Is this a thing? It is a thing, and things happened. So... I don't see any difference uh, on this side. Looks like it's the exact same thing in another switch, so maybe that'll do something. So, same, same circumstances, just do everything the exact same. In fact, you know what? Uh, let's have Luca use Mega Bomb because why not? I'm hoping it's fire. It's it counts as fire, and oh my god, the damage! Oh, I like it. So that's like three times as effective as fire or one. So that makes me happy. So we'll keep that in mind. And they actually got off an attack. That does not make me happy. You can die. Okay, I'll say that again. You can die. Thank you. Luka actually did a lot of damage with that. Was that a critical? Hmm, I wonder. Anyway, let's press this switch. And it kind of just did the exact same thing the other switch did. And there's no noticeable difference. Um, does this do a thing now? Oh, sure enough, it does. Okay, well, awesome. I'll take it. And that opens the path forward. And that looks a little odd. And it looks like... Yeah, it looks like it's like under the lava on the sides and it's it's okay um so now we have a save point and an elixir okay can we go along the walls or anything nope okay so there's nothing else here uh we need to use a shelter because we are running low on things go ahead and use that we're actually running low on shelters four left might need to buy some when we get back into the overworld um and we'll save Save number 42. 34, 32, and 31. Why is Robo so low of a level? Oh well. Uh, let's move on. And this looks like a boss room if I've ever seen one. Uh, oh, it's Dalton. You made it this far. Maybe I underestimated you. Maybe you did. But this is the end. They will take care of you. Come, Golem Twins! Wait, is that like that monster that we fought in the one place? It is. Okay, so... So... Oh, uh, oh, there's two of them. Okay, there's something I want to test out. Last time, the golem used the... Okay, thank you. It used the same kind of move that we used on it. We used a physical attack on it, and so it used physical attacks back. So if we use elemental attacks, will they use elemental attacks? They will! Now here's another question. If I change the element they use, does that reset their counter? Because if it does, 
I think I just figured out the thing, the thing to this battle. Uh, fire two. So we can just alternate between these three kinds of magic and kind of buffer them out forever. Seems like that's how it's going to go. And that makes me extremely happy. They still haven't attacked other than those two physical attacks at the beginning. And Luca's magic is obviously much more powerful than ours. Oh no, we waited a bit long on that one. Oh well, that's not too bad. At least we're getting critical, or we're getting counterattacks off on him. And we can always heal if we ever have a problem. So we might want to buffer these out a bit more. So like, wait and go. So everyone else's techs can reload before we do that. And if we get the right timing, it seems like it should work. And Robo's attacks are obviously going to do less damage because he's a robot and uh, he's using a weaker move. Go! Okay, so that should give us enough time with Robo. Um, Chrono's going to run out of MP faster than everyone else because his stuff reloads faster. Do the thing! Okay. See, he's going like twice for every time they go. So that's a thing to keep in mind. Um... Boop. And I wonder, will Mega Bomb hit both of them? No, they are not in the bomb area, so that's not gonna work. That would be pretty sweet if it did, though. Go. And that should be enough time. See, Chrono's gonna be going again. I guess I could go with Robo and, like, even it out. By the way, this is totally working like I thought it would. I love that. See, things work when you think things out. Last time, the golem just annihilated us because we just used physical attacks to do the whole thing. And it wasn't fun. But now we're going against two, and they're hardly even getting a chance to attack. I'm enjoying this immensely. Okay, so Chrono's going to be coming up next. Uh, we might need to heal. Because... Yeah, well, just in case they get off an attack. Like that. Um, you know what? Let's go ahead and use Heal Beam. We should have enough time with Lucas. So we should be able to get that off, and it should be happy times. Uh, Robo, however, is still at full HP. And that's a lot of HP. 781 is nothing to scoff at. Man, I love that HP increasing ring. Now he'll up 200 of each of ours. Hurry up, get off the fire before they do the thing, and we should be good. I wonder how much HP they have. I think, I think it seems like we've done at least like 5,000, to me at least. And that's the right amount of buffer, and it makes me happy. This is actually getting kind of boring with how easy it is. Come on, give me a challenge. Wait, what? No, 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 no. Do the thing, and they're getting an attack off. This is an all attack. Okay, so yeah, it's a good thing we healed. Uh, you actually, no, you go first, because I want you to be able to do the thing. And you will need to, uh, redo your stuff. I'm gonna have to give him an elixir or something. Or an ether, I'm not sure which it is. Uh, wait a while so we can have Robo do the thing. Actually, you know what? I'm going to have... Oh. Oh, they have attacks when they die. Um. Oh, we should be fine whenever the other one uses it, too. Uh, you go ahead, use laser spin. I shouldn't have to use laser spin. Uh, actually, you know what? Can you use lightning one? Because we only have one now. And the other one died first because, uh, because of the counterattacks. So that's good. Uh, you should die. Actually, you know what? Die now. Oh! Oh, that's not good. Okay, well, Chrono might actually be dying. That's gonna kill him. Oh, wait, no, if you kill it with physical attacks, it doesn't do the thing? I guess. Okay, well, Chrono survived that. Robo leveled up, and it's good times. They beat the Golem Twins? Alright, this calls for the Golem boss. Um, so another boss fight? What's this strange force? Could this be Lavos's energy? Uh, well, you are kind of, you know, summoning him. You better have a bad feeling about this. All this, all my work will be in vain if I expire before I'm immortal. Oh, so that's the ultimate goal here, becoming immortal. 
this is your lucky day. Bye bye. That's that's too innocent of a farewell for an enemy like that. Uh, should we go back and heal? I think we should. I'm going to just in case. I'm also going to save because reasons. Ah, uh, but I don't want to use a whole shelter again. Because what if we don't have to... I, uh, you know what? Precautions. We can always buy more afterwards. And I'm also going to save just in case so we don't lose our lose that battle. It was pretty easy, but still, it was, I know, it was like a whole eight minutes long, so, um, hi there. <laughs> Can we scratch your back too? This is the Hall of the Mammon Machine. Now's the time to turn back. New. No. Oh, okay. Uh, he committed suicide, and now I'm scared. We just made, we made it just in time. It's a pity, but I'll have to turn this machine off. A gravitational pull? I sense a dimensional warp. Wow, they're... Good thing we have the two smart people with us. You're... Uh, yeah, we are. Help! Oh no, Shala's not okay, and the Prophet's worried. What are you doing, Shala? I need your help here. Uh, dude, can you like... Well, not dude, but... Queen, can you not see she's, like, having problems? There's no time! Actually, we have all the time of the world. We can time travel. Use a knife from Melchior to stop the Mammon Machine. Alright, well, I guess we can't really do any uh, things. Uh, here we go, Mune, said Massa. Re ready, big brother. Wait, are they in this? Okay. The machine's energy changed the knife into a sword? Uh, I suppose it did. I don't know. Sprite limits, I don't know. The, the Mammon Machine. It's coming! <laughs> Uh, yeah. No, no, stop. The sword alone can't stop it. Uh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. This isn't okay. That is a noise that I never want to hear ever again. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh. This isn't okay. Um... Um, well, I guess it's a good thing we healed. Uh, holy crap. Excuse me? Well, I'm going to take a guess and say that that's scripted. That's probably supposed to happen. Yeah, yeah. I've waited for this. Whoa! Excuse me? No? I swore long ago that I'd destroy you, no matter what the price. It's time to fulfill that vow. Feel my wrath, Lavos. Okay, so Magus is here. Um. 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 A false prophet. You'll be a snack for the great Lavos. Mother, please stop. This power can only end in ruin. Um, quite obviously. Get away from there, Shala. Actually, this is a really, like... This is a really important scene. The almighty life force of Lavos lives in all of us. You're a part of it. You cannot change fate now. Oppose me and I will destroy you also. Dude, that's like your daughter, isn't it? You can't. Come, Prophet. Feel the power of Lavos. Alright, well, Magus is going to take on Lavos, I guess. Ung! My powers are being drained. That's... I, I don't know. Is that good? Is Magus on our side? I won't be beaten. I survived the darkness to defeat you, Lavos. Oh boy. Take this, Lavos. Well, the enemy of our enemy is our friend, so... I guess. W what? It didn't work? Ugh. Um, nope. Doesn't look like it worked. Well, now we're all dead. Foolish one, your measly power can't touch Lavos. This is from me to you. You shall enjoy internal life as part of Lavos. Wahahaha! <laughs> it's hard not to give her a masculine voice, being the enemy and all. That and I don't do girl voices. Oh, we're not dead. At this rate, we'll all... Uo? The dimensional warp is getting bigger. We cannot stay. Uh-oh. Um, Chrono, you just gonna stand there? Um, maybe help? Maybe? 
Okay. Yeah, don't worry. Yeah. Important stuff. Eventually. Any day now. Yep. This is... I... I mean... Uh... Can we... You know... Well... How long is this gonna drag out? I don't want to have a longer than 30 minute episode. Oh, we can move! Oh! <laughs> Haven't given up yet? What do you hope to do? You challenge Lavos with that battered body of yours? Mwahaha! See the power of Lavos and feel his wrath. Um, well, we will take you on. Um, what's happening? I have to make sure that I can't move. Stop, Chrono! Chrono. I'm gonna start- I'm gonna start giving Robo a robot voice. I feel like that would make it better. Also... Did we just do a thing? Oh no, that's not okay. Of all the things that are okay, that is definitely not okay. Well... That's not good. So what becomes of us now? I can't beat him. Lavos. Chrono, there was nothing I could do. The palace is collapsing. We must escape now. I'm nailing it. I'm nailing that voice. Ooh, music! God, music! The last of my pendant's power will send you to safety. I know you can't forgive her, but please don't hate Mother or our kingdom. I'm so sorry. Now off you go. Alright, so they're getting out of here safely, but what happened to Chrono? Chrono. Well, I don't know. I don't know what to say. I mean, this is a lot to take in. Oh. 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 Okay. Um. Jeez, I... Wait. Isn't that... Isn't that part of a... Another place? Oh well. So, yeah. Uh, the Kingdom of Zeal is kind of... Screwed. Uh oh. Yeah, this isn't okay. Oh, jeez. Completely annihilated. I think it'd be a bit more than that if something just collided with Earth. A tidal wave! Yep, there you are. That's what happens. Ooh, jeez. That looks nice, though. Gotta say. Well, what do you do? Um... Hold it, Chrono. Wait, what? Chrono. It's too dangerous, Chrono. Chrono. Oh, they're dreaming. Darn. Um, you're awake. Wait, what? The, the, the apostrophe was after the R? That's not right. You were delirious. Chrono, where's Chrono? We found no one else. So it wasn't a dream. Is this the earthbound village? 
This is the island this island was the only refuge left after the Ocean Palace disaster. This is so depressing. No era is safe, and there isn't much of a future to look forward to. Is Sir Melchior here? When the disaster struck, an eerie black portal materialized. Melchior tried to save Janus, but he was also dragged in. A black portal? No doubt, a gate made by Lavos. What about Shala? I don't know. No one's seen her since. Epoch isn't intact. Your ship is quite sturdy and safe. It's almost as if it followed you here. Oh, this must be yours. Okay, so at least we still have our time machine. Marl's pendant, the one that Chrono kept for her. It was at your... Oh, wait, no. Well, wrong voice. It was at your side, like a guardian. Chrono. Take all the time you need to rest. I'll be in the comments. Alright, well... Jeez, this is a lot. Oh, no, we don't have Chrono anymore. So that actually happened. I didn't think that would actually happen. Okay, well, we haven't used Marl in a while. Um, let's go ahead and do it like this. We'll give the girls some time to shine. That should do us. Alright, so with that, man, what a development. Go ahead and save. Still while those beckons, I guess. So, man, join us next time when we figure out what to do. I mean, this is big developments. See you all then. And goodbye.